Hi, I'm Julie from WRWDW.com. Today I wanted to talk a little bit on some great ways to save on souvenirs when you go to Disney World. Um, whenever I talk about this, I always like to try to blame my children, saying that they love to bother me about, oh, can we buy this, can we buy this? But the truth is most of the time it's me. I love to buy souvenirs when I'm at Disney and I also love to save money. So here are some of the ways that I've come up with to save on some great souvenirs while at Disney World. Um, first, and I only recommend this if you have a day off from the parks, like if you have a little bit of extra time, um, check out the Disney Character Warehouse. It's an outlet store, it's not on Disney property, so if you don't have a car or a rental car, you're gonna wanna take um, a Lyft or an Uber over there, but it is an outlet store run by Disney and it's all Disney official merchandise for about half of the price, which is awesome. So if you have a little bit of extra time, I would highly suggest hopping in an Uber and going over there to check it out. The downside is you might not get specifically you know, characters or things that you're looking for, but if you just want to browse some awesome souvenirs with your family, this is a great place to go and save some cash uh, while doing it. Um, my second suggestion is a shop in Disney Springs. So if you're spending an evening or a day checking out all the stores in Disney Springs, the Uniqlo shop in Disney Springs is huge and it's all Disney clothing and apparel. So if you're looking for some Disney specific clothing, is a great store and they have a ton of inexpensive Disney items. So if you were to just go to one of the other Disney specific shops and look for like a t-shirt, you might end up spending like 40 bucks on a t-shirt there. So at Uniqlo, they have a ton of stuff and it's about half the price. So it's a great find if you're looking for clothing as your souvenir um, for Disney. Um, one of my other suggestions is getting your Disney ears before you go to the parks. If you look on Etsy, there are a ton of fantastic sellers who sell awesome, very specific Minnie Mouse ears, or not even Minnie, any character you can think of. They sell a ton of ears, and you can get them at a fraction of the price. So like, I do Disney for a living, and so I am a, a grown woman who can wear my mouse ears. Now, the rest of us, most of us are not gonna be wearing Minnie Mouse ears on a daily basis. So when you get to the parks, you might not wanna spend what they are charging for the ears, knowing like, I'm gonna wear this for a week and it's gonna be awesome, and then what do I do with it when I'm at home? I've spent all this money on these ears, and then what? If you can find a seller on Etsy ahead of time, you can get some awesome ears for a fraction of the price that Disney might charge you, and you can find people who are gonna make specifically what you are interested in, which is awesome. So endless options, a variety of prices that can fit any budget. Um, and along those lines, there are also a ton of great DIY Minnie Mouse ears, and I've pinned several to my Pinterest page. If you wanna check out my Pinterest page, I have a ton of them, because I think that is a super fun way to not only save money, but to like get your kids involved and excited about going to Disney World before you go. So check out my Pinterest page, because I have a ton of them on there that I think are fun and cute. Um, and lastly, one way that I, every single time I go to Disney World, I try and save money on souvenirs is by getting discounted gift cards ahead of time. And there are a few ways you can do this. Um, if you go to Sam's Club, if you have a membership for Sam's Club, they will often sell three packs of gift cards at a discount. And their discount varies, so I'm not sure exactly what it is right at this moment. But you can get those gift cards at a discount. If you have a Target red card, you save 5% on those Disney World gift cards. Or the, they say Disney Store, but they work at the parks. You can use them for souvenirs, for food. You can even use them for your um, hotel package or your park tickets as well. So that's another great option. And what's fun about that, what I do with my kids, is before we leave for Disney, I give them each a gift card with a dollar amount. And then I don't have to hear, mom, mom, can we buy that, can we buy that? Because they know I have X amount of dollars, it's my gift card, I can spend it however I want, and when it's gone, it's gone. So those are some fun ideas on how you can save money on your Disney World trip on your souvenirs that you have to have. And I will see you in the parks.